Hello, my name is Oliver Knott and I am sitting here in my aqua room, a training center for aquascaping. I am a professional aquascaper in Germany and I want to introduce you a new plant or a new kind of plant. It's called Linea Cup. It is an in vitro plant uh, growing in a laboratory and uh, it's producing by an Italian plant company called Anubias, a very traditional company in Italian. So what is in vitro? In vitro is coming from the lab, it's growing in the lab and uh, the, the big fortune of this plant, for, especially for aquascaper, is uh, that the plant is 100% snail free, 100% algae free and 100% pesticide free. So you can use it in uh, shrimp tanks very easy or in every traditional planted tank. So I just want to show you how to use uh, these caps. For example, we start with a very traditional plant like Eliocharis, a uh, uh, small hair grass. You remove the cup and then you can then you can see the plants. You put it outside and you can see how big it is and how much quantity you have. And then you can uh, use the Eliocharis like this. You see how much plant you have in this side and then only for example this is a small tank I just want to explain you how to uh, use the the Eloisharis you rem remove just a little bit of the hair grass like this For example take a pin set and put it inside a gravel and the next and you can imagine how much you can use with one, one cup so uh, also one fortune of the in vitro cups are that the plants are still in the submerged version so this they can grow very easily under water and so you use the Eliosharis every two three centimeter and you can plant this at least 10 square centimeter from the tank with one cup, mostly more. You can see the small Buddha tank here. This is a uh, test, this is a concept aquarium and I use only two caps for this uh, small tank and then you can grow it, you can see, very easily to a carpet and this is just to explain you how to use a traditional plant like this. There's a lot of sorts available like Cryptocorina Power, Hemianthus, Calitrichoides, Glossostigma, so a lot of uh, traditional aquascaper plants and uh, just try it and it's a very, very interesting uh, aquascaping plant. So, I remove this and I just want to explain you uh, other kind of uh, plant also from in, from in vitro, also a linear cup and how to use. This is richer, richer fluitans, a traditional aquascaping plant for uh, making really nice carpets. And how to use? You take a small cap like this. A fishing line at least 0 0.16 millimeter, very uh, thin. I make this, put it in the cap. Open the cup and then you take a flat uh, stone like this maybe two three centimeter or a little bit more just put a little bit of the richer on the top of the stone like this and then take the fishing line and roll it like this. Don't scare about the richer, they don't die because of the strong um, rolling. And very important that you use a fishing line for richer, for example, uh, also all uh, Anubias linear cups also available in um, mosses, willow moss, weeping moss, vesicularia. And so when you use uh, um, mosses, you can use um, a wool.
a green blue line but for richer please use a uh, fishing line because richer is not available to attach on the on the on the ground at the beginning so just roll it like this very strong so and we make the finish it's a little bit you have to be training a little bit so uh, Normally you have to use, you make, if you want to make a, a richer layout, you have to use about uh, for 10 square centimeter, you need maybe 10, 10 of these stones. So it's a lot of work, but the success is will be about 100% if you make it like this. I just remove this here and this here. So you have the finished richer stone, very easy. You can make it smaller, a little bit bigger, no problem. And I take you my test aquarium like this here again. And then you put the richer stone, very important, a little bit in the gravel. Just a little bit. And the next beside. And the next beside. So you can have a finish richer carpet and it's a really nice thing so i hope you enjoy this little bit little small introduction for the linear cup from manukas and i hope you will test it it will be a really nice experience especially for the aquascapers just try it and uh, i hope to see you again bye <laughs>